So, uh, when does she arrive? When the pretty girl walks in? Blind date, then. Mm. Well, uh, good luck with that. You're beautiful. Oh, you're <laughs> sweet. I'm Melissa Johnson. You're Scooter, right? I'm Scooter. Oh, nice to meet you. I I'm so sorry that I'm late. Um, one of my students caught me as I was leaving the office. So you're a professor, huh? That's cool. I'm a professor at the University of Santa Cruz. Oh yeah? What subject? Permaculture. I'm in the environmental studies department. What's that? It's a sustainable farming, you know, not using pesticides, that kind of thing. One of those new agey classes? It's not at all. Well, I mean, you know what I mean. It's like kind of a pipe dream, nothing really tangible. You know, permaculture is a system that has existed for thousands of years. Indigenous cultures all over I the mean, world. Real, you know, real like underwater basket weaving's real. Okay, um, I'm a really busy person. I don't have time for people like you. Have a nice life, Scooter. You're such a boner, Scooter. What? Well, you know, you get a girl, get an opportunity, and then you blow it. I mean, you should try something different. Not this Craigslist thing. Try something like uh, greendates.net. Hold on, I got it right here. You can check out her profile, see a girl, get together, you know, get a little save the earth action. All right, I think the scooter can work this angle. No, that is my car. <sighs> how, where do you, how do you do that? Oh, you blow my mind. Oh. What is she? I don't want to hear so. Okay, she gets you this way. Go away. Thank you, Patrick. Ashley. Skinner. <sighs> wow. <laughs> I gotta admit, I, uh, I don't do this internet dating thing much, and it's just been so hard to find a girl who's as eco-conscious as I am, and someone as beautiful as you. <laughs> oh, shucks. I know what you mean. It's hard to find people who care about the environment. Earth Day every day. That's my motto. Oh, that is so sweet. Mother Nature hears your compassion. I love Mother Earth. You are awesome. Do you want to do some eco shenanigans with me? I'd love to. What are you doing? What? Drying yourself with paper towels? Yeah, I get these for free at work every day. It's awesome. What about Earth Day is every day? Do you realize how wasteful that is? Not only are you killing trees, but you are also contributing to landfills. Oh, and you know those styrofoam cups in your kitchen? They will never biodegrade. Not even in 10,000 years. Bio do what? Bio degrade. Gee, Scooter, I thought you really cared about the environment. It turns out you just want people to think you do. 
You have completely missed the point. I can't believe I thought I liked you. Goodbye. Oh. So how'd it go with the granola girl? Did you uh, get her in the sleeping bag? I blew that one. I never thought I'd say this either, but I was actually starting to like her. Well, don't worry about it, man. There's plenty of fish in the sea. Actually, at the rate that our fisheries are depleting, we're going to be out of bluefin tuna in less than 10 years. That whole green thing's really starting to go to your head, isn't it? No, uh, it's not that. It's just... You know, she lives so passionately. I mean, I want to live like that, but... I blew it and it's too late. No, it's never too late.